In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to configure the profile settings in BuddyBoss platform. To get where I'm at, you're gonna to wanna to go to BuddyBoss settings and then click on profiles. And here we can see we have a few options. So one is the display name format. Before I get into this, I'll show you that under profiles, we have three profile fields that are required. And those are first name, last name, and nickname. Those are used during registration and they also sync with the user data. So if I go edit a user profile on the back end, we can see first name, last name, nickname, which is going to sync against these fields. So if you update them in the WordPress users table or you, the user updates it in their profile, they're always gonna sync. And the reason we use all this data is it allows us to display the name any way we want. So if I view my profile, we can see it says Michael. If I go to my timeline, Michael put updated their profile. I'm gonna set it to first name and last name. And now it's gonna display my full name everywhere, or I can set it to nickname. And now it's going to display just my nickname or my handle, which I can change at any time. So nickname would be useful for a kind of private network where you want people to be anonymous. You can always go into the profile fields and for example, take last name and say the visibility is only me. And that way the user who's logged in, only they will see their last name, no one else will, if you wanted to do it that way. And if I go back here, first and last name is really useful for like an internet or some kind of professional network where you want to expose it purposely, their whole name. So as you may know, I've talked about in other videos, BuddyBoss platform is a fork of BuddyPress. The reason we forked it is because BuddyPress was missing a lot of features that we thought were important for our members based on the customer feedback we get all the time. So this is one of those examples. We had customers constantly uh, asking us, can I display the full name or just an anonymous handle? And with BuddyPress, it was really hard to do. We'd have kind of crazy ha workarounds to make it happen. And now you just have it out of the box. So let's move on to some other options. You'll note that we have here, it says, after the form has been updated, remember to run repair community tools. So if you have like a thousand users on here and you make this toggle, and then we see have options for photo uploads and cover photo uploads. So if I go back to my profile, you see I have a profile photo and a cover photo. So I'm gonna edit my profile photo. I can pick a picture here. So I'll go with this one. And it's gonna let me crop it. And now if I view my profile, suddenly I have a profile photo and I can also change my cover image to the same method. So let's pick an image. All right, I'll use this one. And now when we view my profile, we have cover photo. So under here, you can turn off cover photos. And that goes away. And we can turn off avatars and so the avatars are still there if you turn them off but the user can't ever change it and then i'm just going to show you some more stuff if you're using buddy boss theme our premium theme you have some options here under theme options cover photos to adjust some things so let me just turn these back on and we can adjust this is for profiles and groups. We can adjust, let's say the width and the height so I can make it full width and a large photo. So you can see the difference. And I can also set a default cover image if I want. So this user already has a cover image set, but for newly registered users, it would set a default image on their profile. 